Today on Metaphysical Mississippi, we'll be speaking with John Yoko. He'll be talking about an event to elevate, which is going to be held at Dooley Hall on July 1st at 6 p.m. here in Jackson, Mississippi. It's Heart Sounds and Soul Jams. It's a conscious event presented by the Holistic Hearts Collaboration in Jackson Healing Arts. Plan to come out to this immersive sound experience and holistic bazaar featuring the Jason Daniels Band, Betsy Berryhill, Good Job, and DJ John Warren. Tickets available at Ticketmaster as well at Jack Zinn and in person at Dooling Hall the day of the event. So stick around. John Yoakum with us. So good to have you here today, John. Thank you for having me, Emily. Yes, yes, and we're going to be talking about Elevate. I have a flyer right here. And it is on our website, metaphysicalms.com. And I'm sure Holistic Hearts Collaborative also has information on its Facebook group. Correct, on, on Instagram page. and Facebook as well. Okay. And Jack Zinn. And, and Jack Zinn Healing Arts Center. Okay. Correct. So, it's a collaboration between Holistic yes. Arts and Jack Zinn. Yes. So um, we are going, y'all will be having an Elevate. It is a Heart Sound Soul Gym event July 1st at 6 p.m. at Julie Hall here in Jackson, Mississippi. Correct. And it's going to be, it sounds wonderful and fun. Tell us a little bit about it. Yeah, so we're super excited about this event. We feel that it's a very unique and special experience, um, especially here in the Jackson, Mississippi area. So it's a conscious uh, collaboration, uh, basically a conscious concert and immersive sound experience and holistic bazaar. So the doors are gonna open at six o'clock and that's when the holistic bazaar will start. We're gonna have several consciously curated vendors uh, there will be food there, uh, drinks. Uh, we'll have, we're gonna have healing artists set up, massage therapists doing chair massage. Uh, we'll be doing, we'll have Reiki practitioners as well. Um, I know Debbie's gonna be doing uh, yoga therapy. And uh, we'll also have yoga with Scott O'Brady and myself at 6.15. So w the, the ticket and everything gives you access to that as well. So we, we wanna, let everybody know that the Holistic Bazaar is a very important component of the show. And then at 7.30, the sound immersion will start. So it's basically a concert um, with the artists that we have listed. So we've got um, our opening act will be uh, Betsy Berryhill. She's an acoustic singer-songwriter, very indie, um, just an amazing voice. It just draws you in. We, we really feel that uh, people are going to connect with her. Um, and then we have Jason Daniels Band, uh, local favorite, uh, kind of a mix of psychedelia, funk, bluesy, folky. Uh, those guys are amazing, and we have something super special lined up um, incorporating them in the sessions uh, in between, and we'll talk about that in a second. And then we've got um, community legend uh, Fifth Child doing amazing things. He's a local hip-hop producer and lyricist, rapper, um, just doing amazing things at the Briarwood Arts Center and just an amazing guy, super uplifting lyrics, soulful. I mean, this guy is super talented, even as a producer and uh, just his lyrics and everything are super uplifting. Um, and what is super cool is that these two actually recorded a track together a few years ago that they're gonna be performing live at the end. Oh, and it's, awesome. oh my gosh, it's such an amazing track. Like we're very excited. And then uh, afterwards, we'll have a dance set with myself at the end, uh, to kind of as the, uh, the ending of the event. Um, but what is really cool about this event is that we're going to have some local sound healers um, that are going to be interweaving sonic alchemy in between these artists, building the energy as the energy of these artists progress uh, throughout the evening. Um, so that will be some of the members of Holistic Hearts and uh, we'll be sound healing anything from singing bowls, to ocean drums, uh, actual drums, buffalo drums, and just a whole array 
of instruments really, and we're just super excited. So essentially we're, we're telling one continuous sonic blissful story throughout the evening um, as the energy progresses. And uh, yeah, we're, we're super excited. Yeah, Glen Hall has a great sound system and it has a lot of performers come through there. Yes, yes, and, and I would say yeah. just in, in my humble opinion, um, you know, as far as like intimate uh, events and live music venues in the Jackson area, That's I would say they're they're the place to be. Oh, right. <laughs> so I'm still kind of yeah. like pinching myself, like, yeah. oh my gosh, this is this really is happening. So here. exciting! And um, as far as food vendors go, um, will uh, will it just be um, anything special? Do you have anything for those that are vegan or those who have? It will. Yes, and, and one of our food vendors that we're going to have there, and uh, I, I know that there's going to be, I think, some other, there's like restaurants and other like snacks and things in the area, but we yeah. will have uh, Sweet Peas Vegan Eatery yeah, and fine. Catering, uh, Diamond, she'll be providing uh, vegan food for your uh, culinary pleasure, so we, we feel good yes. about her. At your last event, I just heard raves about her food Oh man! from the last event you had <laughs> in... Um, at Cedar at Tree Farms. Oh, I wish yes. I could have attended, but I know many people who went. And it, it was an amazing time, and, and Diamond, thank you so much yeah. for your food. It is It was so amazing, and we're very excited for you to be back. Yes. So, um, so when the healers are there um, before, uh, will they all have little set-up areas? They will. So, to provide um, services? Yes. So we'll have, there will be a two chair massage, uh, two massage therapists doing chair massage. Uh, there will be three people offering like Reiki and energy clearing. And, uh, and then we'll have uh, Debbie Lewis who will be doing yoga therapy. Yeah, with and, yoga, right? Correct. And, and they'll all be kind of set up in the back half. It'll be a very intimate, you know, feel. Um, and then there's also yes. a back patio that opens up where people can lounge and Every, all the vendors and everything will be inside. So, you know, regardless of what the weather does, we're covered, like the show will go on and it'll, it'll be beautiful. So did you come up with this idea to do Elevate? Or was it a collaborative, like you and another person, like this would be cool. Right, right. So <laughs> I, I feel like, I feel like there were definitely different people in like this collective vision and it really feels like divine timing with, so at Resonance, we had um, the multi-healer sound bath yes. and was just such a beautiful experience and was such a, a super part, a super grateful experience to be a part of. And um, and that was uh, Lindley Healy, Ben Tripp, William Kelly, and myself. Um, Jason Lee was supposed to be there, but he had some things that came up and wasn't able to make it. But um, but she will be here for this one. So um, we're super excited about it. And uh, yeah, so it was, uh, honestly, Jason Daniels and I got to talking um, after Resonance. And uh, as many of you know, he uh, fronts the Jason Daniels band. Yeah. And I feel like we were both like in this place of, of thinking about just uh, fusing, you know, a consciously curated concert that people could jam out to and, you know, have all the feels, but be able to interweave sound healing into that. So essentially it's this meeting place of sound healing uh, with music and, and a concert and just kind of blending all the things together and uh, just being very intentional, you know, about the acts that we have that we'll be performing as well as the sound healers and just kind of telling this story with the energy of the the sounds and the music. Yeah, I think it, it's cool how, you, you know, with, with sound bath or with drumming, you know, uh, you're concentrating, that's really uh, interweaved with healing. But then to bring it into a band and mainstream type music, sort of, I don't know if that's right to say, but you know, I, I I forget how healing just listening to a song on the radio is, Absolutely. too, and how it can just bring you there and touch that little part of you. So yes. I mean, and you're going to be bringing in words, 
It's not just going to be music, but poetry. Absolutely. With lyrics. And, and so I'm, it's going to be exciting. Absolutely. And I'm glad that you mentioned that because that's that's so very true. And, and you know, you know, as a musician myself, and like, it, it's funny because I always, I always tell people that massage therapy, I feel like was my gateway into metaphysics and those types of things. But I think if I'm really being honest, it, it's always been sound and music since I was a child and just roots and percussion and just, it, and, and, you know, and I'm not, you know, unique in that way. Like it moves a lot of us like that. And I think that, you know, on the soul level, you know, music in itself is so healing and just the heart and everything that these musicians and artists put into their craft um, to be able to move people the way that it does and to be able to let those feelings come out the way that it does. Um, it's just a beautiful thing. So yes, so even the the musicians in themselves, what they are doing has a very spiritual connection. So, and I think just being intentional about um, the artists that we're putting together and just the whole flow of the evening, it's, it's gonna be a very, very cool experience. Now, will you be doing a little ecstatic dancing with your set when you go to DJ John Wallen? Right. <laughs> <laughs> when you, or or yeah, is it just so. music? Or is it just everybody just chill out and just listen to the music? What, what's so, kind of the right, type so, of music will you be featuring in that? So after Fifth Child um, finishes his set, um, at that point, we would have been writing... Um, this energetic musical wave throughout the evening with the energy you know coming to a peak and we feel that everybody will be pretty amped up and everything feeling good by the time uh, Fifth Child finishes his set so we're going to finish off the evening with like a half hour um, spiritual dance set so it'll feature you know music that I will be playing like for an ecstatic dance set although this won't be the full ecstatic dance experience um, it'll be a condensed kind of latter half of the ecstatic dance journey oh. and that people can just, you know, feel that energy and then yeah. just lose themselves, you know, to the music and and just a very high vibing dance okay. set. Um, I haven't ever been to the, I know I've asked you the first time we had a, um, we talked about resonance, about um, doing the ecstatic dance and when you do the music. And um, I've had a sound bath. I've had, uh, I have floated, and so. always it takes about a good, and, and I've now experienced Reiki, so it usually takes about a good 45 minutes to hit that spot of like, you know, the first 30, you're like, what's going on here? This is kind of weird. Right. And then I think about 45 is when I really went there to the place. Is that kind of how it's how? The journey takes even through a static dance to kind of once you hit around a 45 minute then you really start your journey right right and, <laughs> and i think that's a good analogy um yes I, and i would say you know and, and of course it's unique to the individual and um mm -hmm. what's really cool about ecstatic dance is that it starts out very very slow and it, and it really works its way through uh, a variety of different feelings and emotions and just kind of riding that wave and and just really being present and feeling the emotions that each part of the journey brings you and and you know and a lot of times so that that can start out really slow and and it, and it kind of builds um but you could definitely say that you know 30 45 minutes into it you know because a, a lot of times as you mentioned with many healing modalities, you know, the first half hour is just getting out of our heads and just like right. all the stressors and all the things that we're thinking about to really kind of get out mm -hmm. of our minds. So once we can get to that place, that's when a lot of the real magic can really happen. And I would say a lot of times uh, with ecstatic dance, that is exactly the case when you can start reading the, reaching those states of bliss and, and ecstasy, which, you know, we feel like with this event, yes, people will probably already be, be there. there. So exactly. we're just going to continue to ride that wave and just connect with our bodies and just uh, and have a good time. Because I because I like how um, you're starting off where when you're dealing with the healing arts, 
you're usually you're laying in still. You know, you're starting off with the right things. The 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 energy is kind of flowing into them, and then I really like how you've got the lineup, and then the music, and then that starts, and then they can uh, demonstrate physically. Right. By the end of the night. Right. Ab absolutely. Yeah. So that's pretty cool. We we feel that it'll be a really good progression of energy. Uh, you know, yeah. we um, actually at seven thirty when the sound immersion begins, uh, Beth is going to start out with an opening speech and meditation, mm -hmm. and then we'll go directly into that. Uh, from that into the first sound healing session, um, we'll we'll have some crystal bowls, some some koshi chime magic, just very ethereal vibes and that's going to transition into Betsy and we'll let her serenade everybody for a while and then uh then we'll come back in and kind of change some emotions with some different sound healing instruments um and then we have something really special uh lined up with with Jason Daniels band uh they're going to come in and we're going to actually uh join in together for a couple of the sound healing sessions like going into their set and then coming back out of it as we build the energy in the last set with the, the drums and it's going to be super special working its way into to fifth child yes. and he'll, he'll take it away from there and work his magic. Oh, it's going to be so much fun. So, um, I think we've already mentioned it, but you can get tickets, um, through Dooley Hall or Ticketmaster as well right. as, um, in person at Jack Zen, yeah. uh, which is in, um, in Jackson, mm -hmm. and um, Dooley Hall, of course, is in Jackson. Um, was there another physical location if they don't do it online that they can pick it up? All right. So, so as of right now, um, it's just Jack at Jackson Healing Arts Center uh, in Midtown. It's behind Millsaps on uh, Wesley Avenue, off of uh, West Street, and uh, so you can pick up your physical copy there as well as uh, at the box office in Dooling Hall. They have an office there about midways down. And uh, you can pick up your physical copy there as well. Um, and then also you can use the QR code um, on the flyer to also register. We do have a few physical flyers around town or you can do that uh, online or just use the Ticketmaster link. Um, and you can find that, that link on Instagram and Facebook um, at Holistic Hearts or Jackson and also Dueling Hall. July 1st, 6 p.m. Dueling Hall, it's gonna be great, Elevate. We're so, super excited. This yeah. Saturday, you guys, yes. 6 p.m. Be but, there or be there. Yeah, $33. <laughs> and tickets are available at the door as well. Yes, yes. And, and I'm glad you said that. Um, mm -hmm. You know, if you just want to keep it easy peasy, not have to worry about going in anywhere or anything, just show up. You can buy them the, the night of and it'll be perfectly fine and, and we'll have a beautiful experience. So we're super excited. Yeah, thank you. Thanks, John. Thank you, Emily. <laughs> thank you for having me. All right. Um, as well, you can find out more information at Holistic Hearts Collaborative on Facebook and Instagram, as well as Jack Zan will also have information on their website, as well as metaphysicalms.com will also have their information on our calendar. All right. Y'all have a good, have a good day. <laughs> Bye. Thanks, guys. See you there. <laughs>